Hey guys, Captain Sid here again. Thanks for tuning in to our YouTube channel. It's been a really, really busy month here at Operation Milson. We've been getting a lot of wicked new products. Thanks to everybody who subscribed. If you haven't subscribed already, you need to get on that because we've got the exclusive products that you're not going to find anywhere else in Ontario right here at Operation Milson. Just like what we're reviewing today, we've got something super nice in this little case right here. For all you Milson players, you're looking for a really, really nice barrel kit that's inexpensive. I'm telling you right now, you're going to go gaga ape shit over this. This is Flask's brand new Milsom Barrel Kit. Now I know it's on the laptop, so I apologize that you're kind of getting a shitty angle right now. But I'm going to pull out each part and I'm going to show you guys what this barrel kit's all about. So right off the bat, it comes with three different barrels. We've got a 7 inch, a 9 inch and an 11 inch barrel. On top of your three different barrel links, you've got four different barrel tips in it. You've got this little really quiet muzzle brake, your wire cutter, your dishka, and your four prong tip. On top of that, there's also an apex ready tip that you can throw on with a little three inch extension right at the end. Throw on your apex tips, even though I personally don't like them. I know a lot of you woods ballers do and swear by them. Kit comes with an apex ready tip, so you can toss it right on there. Pull it right off if you don't like it where you're at in the game. And a 3-inch extension. So with this barrel kit, you get about 45 different combinations of barrels that you can create. You want to go CQB style, you can throw this guy on there, a 7-inch barrel. And now you've got a super, super quiet, deadly accurate really tight tiny CQB barrel with the matter of a couple of twists and if you want to scare your opponent make their heads go down and make them think that you're really laying down some suppression fire toss on that disc right there and I'll tell you what we're actually gonna throw this on a marker so you can see firsthand exactly how these barrels look on a marker how they shoot and how loud it really really is so I have my BT4 assault here with some paint already loaded up. Basically, that's also on this barrel right here. Throw some paint down range. So right away you can see that is a super tight barrel on there. It's really, really tiny. About the same size as your stock barrel, but you'll see that the effect that this has is uh, much more devastating than any stock barrel could ever have on any of your markers. So, test fire. And then now, all, all of a sudden, I've got their heads down. I want to go into sniper mode because their heads are down, they're bunkered down in their bunker right now. You're able to go ahead, pull off that tip really, really quick. Say you've got a couple of tips in your pod pack or you've got a little pouch in your scenario vest. Throw a couple of these tips in there. Get into your next bunker, throw on your nice little quiet guy, and you can literally sneak up and start popping shots off, and they're not going to hear where it's coming from because they've been looking down too long because of that loud dishka barrel. So, that's fire. Now, you've gotten out of the CQB environment, you push into an open field, you need something that's going to give you a bit more accuracy at a longer range. Maybe give you something with some more distance. You can go ahead and reach in that scenario vest of yours. Pull out that 11 inch barrel right there. Toss on your tip. Get it right on in there. Throw it right on your marker. And now you can use your barrel to push through any of the tall grass, any of the weeds that you've got. Your bunker down behind maybe. You've gotten into some... Uh, Nice trees, some good cover. You can pull the leaf branches down. You can get your shots off a little bit better. Test fire. With the porting on this 11 inch barrel as well, you'll notice that that was significantly quieter than the 7 inch with the, or with the uh, silence tip on it and with the disco on it, well obviously. So as of right now, Flask is uh, developing these barrel kits to be able to go into retail stores all across Ontario. 
Operation Millicent is working hand in hand with them. That we're going to have these products in stock in the store within the next couple of weeks. We want you guys to tell us what you think about these barrel kits. And again, to give you a real quick breakdown, it comes with this really, really nice wire cutter style tip. This really, really wicked four prong tip. your dishka, and that little silencer frostbite tip that you saw there. Another key feature about these barrel kits is that if you've ever picked up any of the RAT4 Super CQB style barrels for your uh, SP1s, for your A5s, or anything like that, I've got my Super CQB 6 inch barrel. Now what I can do is toss this little Super CQB 6 inch barrel into my marker. The threads just come right out of the tip. So I can now take this tip and screw it right in. So now I've got some super wicked barrel tips. They're also going to be available to sell separately so you don't have to buy the full kit because the kits uh, at this point in time only come in A5 and auto cocker threads. So if you guys run uh, the Super CQB barrel on your SP1s, these tips will be available at Operation Milsom as well as soon as they become available through Flask. And you can throw this is my personal favorite right here. Throw this little dish go on there. And now all of a sudden you've got a super tight, super compact CQB SP1. And especially mine, you know how I like to brag about that black cardboard. 20 balls a second coming out of here is going to sound extremely, extremely fierce. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have that much paint because I'm uh, super broke when it comes to paint. So we don't have enough paint to shoot off through the SP1 today to show you that. But we're going to go on the field in the next few days, take some shots of these new barrels, a couple of the new markers that we've showed you with the new Pinocchio loaders, and uh, hopefully we'll have some in-game action for you coming real soon. This is Captain Sid. Remember to stop on into Operation Milsom. Check out all the awesome products we have. 4544 Queen Street, Niagara Falls, Ontario. Visit our website, OperationMilsom.com. Join up on our forums. That's where the conversation is really going on. Get on in there. And be sure to give us a shout and comment, tell us what you think, and subscribe. This is Captain Sid, guys. Take it easy.